Hey, what's up you guys? I got a Wicked box here, and no, it's not the newest, hottest subscription box. It looks that way, but it's actually Weeklar's own thing. Um, I'm not sure if it's Weeklar, Wiklar, or Wisconsin Klar. Um, they all sound kind of cool, but yeah, I'm not sure which he prefers. But yeah, this is his own thing, and he is another YouTuber that is also a pop hunter, pop collector. He just has collectibles in general, and he is also a big Green Bay Packers fan, and he is also a beast on that claw machine. Wisconsin Clark is such a genuine, kind, and like caring person that it really makes his videos enjoyable, and I watch him all the time. I just think he's a really, really cool dude, and that's why when he was looking for these uh pop playing cards. I actually picked him up some because I guess they didn't have any in his Hot Topic, and I sent him that also with a uh, Spider-Man kind of like museum encyclopedia book that I thought he was really, really going to like, and he, he did. Um, he has an unboxing for that on his channel, which I will link, and yeah, of course him being the cool-ass dude that he is, he wanted to send me something back as like a token of his appreciation, and that's what this Wicked box is. And I'm glad I finally got the time to open this bad boy up, because I really can't wait to see what's inside. Um, yeah, so enough talking, let me get into this thing. I cut the tape already to make it a little quicker. And look at that packaging job. Got bubbles. Got bubble wrap. Looks like semi Masters of the Universe. Oh, what's this? Oh man, and this... I think that's a pop, but it feels hard, so it might be in a... It's probably in a pop protector. Oh my gosh. Alright, let me go through these things individually, because holy shit, this stuff looks so cool already. Alright, the first thing I'm going to open is this Masters of the Universe, the Loyal Subjects Action Vinyls. I actually don't have any of these. And look how cool the artwork on this box is, like... This is really cool. I'm actually really excited about this because, yeah, I've seen a lot of videos of these action vinyls, um, specifically the Power Rangers and the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle ones, but I haven't seen any of these, man. Way to be original, man. Like, awesome. I think when I was a kid, I had, of course, Skeletor. He was one of my favorites. I had Triclops. I had... I don't think any of these, although... Although I didn't have Teal, I had like a She-Ra. And I had the Man-at-Arms, I had He-Man, of course. And I think that was it. But yeah, I loved my He-Man figures. I didn't have a lot of them, but they were cool. And I don't know, I think out of all of these, I would definitely want to have either Skeletor. Any of these would be awesome. Or a He-Man. I mean, they, they all look cool as hell. And the, I mean, this box is so nice, I almost don't want <laughs> don't want to ruin it by opening it. But yeah, let's see what I get here. Alright, so here's his weapons. Oh, and this is the, yeah, the man at arms. Awesome. Oh, man, these, are, these are really nice. Like, these feel really nice. These actually feel like, well, I guess, yeah, it's an action vinyl. So, yeah, I guess it really does feel like, a, like an action figure. Like, man, I would, yeah, these, these are awesome. He got his weapons, and actually comes with like a little, almost looks like a collectible card. If you want to read that, you can pause that. Man, this is really cool. Man, now I'm going to have to get more of these. Yeah, these action vinyls, these are super high quality. And the paint job on this is really cool too, and they're like articulated. I think it's the first uh, mystery box figure I ever had that's articulated. Yeah, really awesome. Yeah, that's cool. Alright, let's move on to the next thing. Have to play with that a little later. And dude, this is so freaking awesome. It's like, I don't know man, how do you do that? This is like, this is something that I would definitely buy if I saw it. This is Exactly the kind of shit I like. This is so freaking cool, man. But yeah, look at this, man. This is freaking awesome. This is going to go right on my desk, and I can't wait to send everybody I know notes on this thing, because this is freaking cool as hell. Like, where did you get this stuff? Yeah, 
That is the most awesome thing ever. <laughs> so freaking cool, dude. And actually, right here on video, the red looks different because I think my camera picks up the different textures um, and kind of interprets them weird. My camera has a hard time with red, but in person, these colors match exactly. It looks like the exact same red. This is freaking cool, man. Like, I'm definitely, definitely going to be using this. It's basically like a white chalk outline. <laughs> this is awesome, man. This is awesome. And I have a feeling that he sent me these because I'm a big Bruce Lee fan. And he is a very perceptive person. And to be honest, I don't know which one I like better. I don't know if I like this pen better or that Murder, Ink pad and pen. But holy crap, look at this. Look at this. This is a pen, but it totally looks like nunchucks. Let's see. That is so freaking awesome, man. <laughs> this is so cool. Nunchuck pen. I want to swing these around, but I want to hit myself in the head with them. But yeah, this is so cool. And I, tell me if I'm right. Do you send me this because you know I'm a Bruce Lee fan? Oh man, this is so cool, dude. Like it's, this is actually my birthday month. I'm born at the end of the month. Um, I'm a I'm a spooky baby. Uh, and I think my family's gonna have a hard time topping these presents already. Like I, I can't wait to go show them off, and be like, look at this cool ass shit that my friend from YouTube sent me. These are cool. Yeah, I don't know. I, I think I'm going to put them both on my desk. This one, I'm probably going to hang it from something. Yeah, this is awesome. Yeah, thanks a lot, man. This is freaking cool, dude. All right. So he wrapped this up, and I'm guessing that's a pop protector. If this isn't a pop, I'm going to feel real foolish. Actually, this box doesn't even look thick enough for a pop. So, yeah, if it's not a pop... Yeah, then I'm going to really surprise, but I, I, I think that's the shape of a pop. Okay, let's go ahead and open this up. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, dude. Are you serious? This is like one of my grails. Holy shit, dude. From 2013. I didn't even realize this was that old. A thousand and eight pieces. Are you serious, dude? Holy shit, man. I don't even know what to say. This is freaking awesome. I love Adventure Time. It's one of my favorite things. This episode is one of the funniest episodes. Like, especially, like right when they bite uh, Jake, it's funny because they bite him on his arm. And he starts running away from his zombie arm so the zombie, the zombie disease doesn't catch him. It's, it's freaking hilarious. And look how well done this pop is. Dude, man, like, you totally outdid yourself, man. Holy crap. I th This has got to be the rarest pop I own now. Holy crap, dude. Yeah, I'm not even taking this thing out. This is definitely going to stay in this protector, and I'm going to put it, like, predominantly in my collection. I might have to take some movies out. And put this guy right into a, a slot there. Um, right in his own slot in my collection. Holy crap, dude. A thousand and eight pieces. Yeah, this is definitely the rarest pop I own. Maybe one of the rarest collectibles I own. I don't, I don't even know what to say, man. I don't even know what to say besides holy crap, oh shit. Holy crap, dude. Like, this is the best, man. This is, I think this is one of the best things I've ever received um, from anybody. Uh, uh, like... As a present for my family, my friends, uh, dude, you are the coolest guy. Like, how did you know that this is definitely, like, one of my grails, man? Holy crap, dude. Yeah, um, I don't even know what to say, man, besides thank you very much, dude. This is the coolest shit ever. 
And I mean, there's like levels of coolness here. Like it's October. It's going to be Halloween. So you sent me a freaking zombie. Um, I'm a big Adventure Time fan. And you sent me one of my favorite characters. And it, this is something that I definitely had like on my list of when I get rich, when I win the lottery, this is one of the pops I'm going to splurge on. I don't care if it's a hundred bucks or whatever. I'm going to buy that zombie Jake. And this is probably the oldest pop that I own, 2013. This is so cool, man. And I don't even know if... I don't even know what to say, dude. Thank you, thank you very, very much, man. You're awesome. Alright, this is my pop room, and this is my main pop wall right here. And as you can see, the pops that I like the most, I put them... Right inside my DVD towers, I moved some of my blue underground DVDs down, just consolidated them down, and was able to make space for one of my new favorite pops, this zombie Jake. And yeah, he's going to be right here at eye level. Totally awesome, man. One of my new favorite pops, probably my top three. This thing is badass, dude. I love it. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Go give Wisconsin Clar a view. Um, yeah, you're probably gonna end up subscribing to him because his fucking videos are awesome. He's awesome. And yeah, this is definitely, uh, I, I just did not expect such generosity from him. And yeah, man, thanks from the bottom of my heart, dude. Take it easy.